Hi, I'm Fran from Be Kind Waste. I'm making this video in collaboration with the Sunnybank Trust, a charity for people with learning disabilities and autism. Today I'm going to show you how to make a bunny from a sock. We'll be using materials that you may already have at home, so it's the perfect Easter activity to do while we're all staying indoors. For this activity, you will need some string, a ribbon, a marker, scissors, an old sock, preferably a light colour, some uncooked rice or an old pair of tights. Step 1. Add your filling inside about halfway up. If you have chosen rice or beans as your filling, you may want to use a mug to help transfer it into your sock. This can help you prevent making a mess and reduces waste. Step 2. Take your string and wrap it round the middle of the sock, just above where you stuffed it. Try not to tie the knot too tight. Step 3. Add more stuffing to the sock. This time you want to create a smaller lump. This will make your bunny head. Step 4. Tie a knot at the top of your stuffing. You should now have three sections. One for the body, one for the head and one for the ears. Step 5. Now let's work on the ears. Cut the top section of the sock in half. Now we are going to shape these sections into ears by cutting at a curve on each section. Keep a hold of those offcuts for later. You can use them as stuffing for more bunnies. Step 6. Let's decorate. Take your ribbon and wrap it round your bunny's neck and fashion it into a bow. Now it's time to draw your bunny's face. Using the marker, Draw two dots where you'd like the eyes to be. This is how I draw the nose. I draw a small X in the middle of the face underneath the two eyes. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make a sock bunny. Here are some ideas you can try at home with your sock bunnies. Why stop at one bunny? You could make a whole family of bunnies. If you have any children's socks at home, these are perfect for the baby bunnies. If you don't have any children's socks at home, you could just snip the top of your sock with some scissors to create a smaller sock for the baby bunnies. Another idea you could try is creating an Easter bonnet with your bunnies. Tie some ribbon around your chosen hat, then you can attach your bunnies to the ribbon with some string. I call this one bouncy bunnies. Attach your bunnies to some string at the back. Now you can hang them up on the window. It will look like they're hopping around outside. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to tag us at Sunnybank Trust and at Be Kind Waste to show us all your bunny photos. Have a great Easter. See you next week.